and my name is Destiny Kameis. We are the students from the Dara Jordan Secondary, Secondary School, School, formerly known as St. Lucie. Our project is a limpet system, also known as the Land Installed Marine Power Energy Transmitter. Our project is to investigate whether or not we can use a limpet system here in Barbados. So to do that, we've built a wave tank, a limpet system, and a and add a wells turbine. So we've we've looked to investigate whether or not we could use a conversion to of we have energy to connect energy to electrical energy. So some of the materials that we use are we have print, printed um, 3D. 3D pieces. And we have also have hinges and acrylic pieces. Uh, we we use silicone and uh, PVC pipe or two. Uh, we also have DC motors, which is. And we also have um, the power supply and the butt down. The butt down is this part, here, which is used to raise or lower the speed of, but is broken at the moment. So I will now show you. To work it. So but we have to use it manually. So previously, this was supposed to sit in here and go like this, so that it would rotate back and forth. But, but it goes, so we have to do it manually. So when she pushes the water up here, it creates waves, and the air that is trapped in here, which you can see on this side, it comes through here to the PVC tube, and it makes this the turbine swing so the air comes out and when she pull it back the air goes in so basically the turbine that is inside no matter which way the air comes it always spins in one direction which is called a unidirectional turbine so basically this is our method um, the tank the wave tank and limpet system were designed in Autodesk Fusion 360 3D modeling software this is a picture of us building the tank and a picture of us building the limpet system. So in result, the air, the ducted with simple river method, that was a success. The turbine spins joint air outflow, that was a success. The turbine spins joint air inflow, that was a success. And increased turbine spins with continuous in and outflow, that was also a success. We had a fail. That fail was the rotation speed to allow the gener to, uh, to generate current with current DC motor. The way we fixed that, we increased wave of limpet system and increased wave energy to increase air speed. So this is also known as a Wells turbine, which is a modified version of this. So basically, we 3D print these so that it could go into this uh, PVC tube so it could be a turbine.